Alright, so in this Blocks Fruits video, I'm going to be taking every single Blocks Fruit and I'm going to be putting it into an AI called Mid Journey. This is Mid Journey. If you don't know what Mid Journey is, it's an AI that if you give it an image, a prompt, or text, it'll generate an image based off of what you gave it. I already tested it out earlier with the Doe Fruit, so here's a photo of what Mid Journey came up with. But yeah, credit to Cy Blocks Fruits on YouTube because that's where I got the idea from. Okay, this may take a while because Mid Journey takes a long time since it's on Discord, and I'm trying to do all the Blocks Fruits, so let's Let's start off with Kilo here. So the photos I'm going to be using look like this and I'm going to paste it into mid journey and here's what I'm going to do. So image with a prompt, I'm going to give this text right here and then I'm going to say fruit. What is this? What do you mean I can't use version 5.2 with only single image prompt? It worked yesterday. What is this? All right, so first off, I put the kilo fruit into the prompt and then I just typed in fruit because apparently you can't put a link in and then just leave it at that. You have to give it like some text prompt. You can see that it's working right now. Here's what Mid Journey has come up with for kilo fruit. And I know that when Sai did it, he got a bunch of faces for some reason and I did it, which is so cool. I like putting fruit in the prompt because then it makes it look more like a fruit. But I guess we could just like say 4K or something. Wow, I was about to put spin fruit in and this person did the CEO Elon Musk dancing in a nightclub realistic. Look at that. Oh my goodness. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to put imagine and then prompt and then we're going to put fruit at the end. Now we wait. Here's what Mid Journey has come up with for spin fruit. And honestly, it just looks like like a cardboard box. This one looks more like a fruit and this one looks like a box holding the fruit. For the next one, I'm going to try not putting fruit and just putting what Mid Journey comes up with. Imagine and then 4K. Because I know Sai when he made this video, he put 4K quality, even though it looks pretty 4k to me even without saying 4k quality this person really likes seeing a bunch of public figures dance in a nightclub that's funny that's crazy okay so i didn't tell it to do a fruit but it automatically put like it looks like a tomato or something like that i know that i said that i would do all the fruits but honestly that takes a long time especially waiting for mid journey to create the images so what i'm going to skip to is i'm going to skip over to flame fruit but i'm still gonna put fruit because they're all technically fruits so i'm gonna put fruit and let's see what it comes up with the flame fruit looks so cool is that like a pineapple head right there is that a dragon fruit i mean there is a dragon fruit in blocks fruit so that's pretty funny this one just looks like a cake okay so this is flame fruit next up i'm putting falcon fruit into mid journey and see what it comes up with i'm really impressed with what mid journey is creating because i'm just taking a photo like this and then i'm telling mid journey to turn it into a fruit and it just does something like this and it looks like a flame fruit so that is pretty cool and this is dark fruit honestly this one is the one that looks closest to the one in blocks fruits and then this one looks like a cake this one looks like a floating island and this one looks like a table decoration or some sort of box that's so cool let's just do 4k quality and see what happens so for the ice fruit i didn't put fruit and i just said 4k quality because that's what side in that's how we got the best results oh my goodness that's crazy it still has ice elements it looks like a snow globe but it has different like scenery inside different landscapes inside the fruit this is honestly the most like beautiful looking one so i'm gonna put ice fruit in here again and i want to see the difference between not putting the word fruit in the prompt and then putting fruit in the prompt and see what difference it makes this looks even better so instead of landscapes inside the ice fruit we now have fruits inside the ice fruit this looks so cool and it kind of looks like a spike fruit, not gonna lie. Okay, so I kind of like when I don't put fruit because then fruit isn't on top of it because it itself has to be a fruit, not fruit beside of it. You know what I'm saying? So you know what we're going to do this time is we're going to put 4K quality and this fruit is the revive fruit and I'm really excited to see what mid journey comes up with. Okay, so here's what we got for revive fruit. The prompt is just the revive fruit, the green revive fruit. Photo is here somewhere. This is crazy. So let's see what happens if I make the revive fruit fruit, I guess you could say. All right, so this is when I gave the prompt fruit. And honestly, this looks like art. Maybe this one as well with the skull. And I like how it's green. It all looks like cakes, which is pretty interesting. What I have up here is I have the rubber fruit. All right, so here's what they came up with for rubber fruit. And I've noticed that when I put 4K, they make it kind of look pixelated or kind of like 
futuristic so i feel like i kind of have to stick with fruit i'm not gonna lie but here's the rubber fruit next one we're going to do the light fruit but i'm gonna put light and then i'm gonna put 4k just to see and here's what they came up with for light fruit this looks so cool this is really cool for what they came up with for light fruit because it just looks like really bright lights i guess next up we're going to do the love fruit but i'm gonna put love and then fruit just to see here's the love fruit that we are currently creating and this is where it gets fun because now i get to play around with like the prompts with like kilo and all that it was kind of like basic but now we go into love fruit i was going to do spider fruit but i am terrified of spiders so i'm not going to put spider as a prompt and then next up we're going to do portal so while love fruit is being created i'm gonna put imagine and then portal so now i could put like portal game or just portal and then i'm going to put glowing and then 4k here is the love fruit and honestly this looks so cool this one in particular i'm not gonna lie i do like this because it's a whole heart i like how there's small hearts on here i really like that but this just looks like it would be created in blocks fruits this looks really cool and i've realized that when i say when i put fruit as a prompt it most likely will put it into like the blocks like shape because when i don't i get something like this let's try to redo this so i put the same thing I put portal glowing, but I also put fruit just to see what happens. This is so cool. So it took elements of the fruit shape, like I said, but then it also made it look like you go in there and you get teleported to somewhere else. It looks like a glowing peach with like a tree on top of it. But I do like this because it has a stem on top. None of them really made the stem that portal fruit has. This is the closest, but I really like this. Next up, we're putting the blizzard fruit and I'm going to put fruit cold blizzard this is probably one of my favorite ones by far when i put the prompt cold blizzard and fruit look at how shiny this apple is and look at these like giant cherries this one just reminds me of going outside in the winter like around christmas time because that's what the ground looks like all right here is where it gets interesting now we're going to put the venom fruit and i'm gonna put venom i don't know if we'll do spider-man venom or like snake venom or something but i'm gonna put venom fruit 4k and we're just gonna see what it comes up with this is really terrifying if i woke up with this like staring at me in the face i would just go to sleep forever that's that's what i would do next up we have the spirit fruit now i don't want to put spirit because i don't want like a bunch of ghosts and stuff like that so i'm just gonna put fruit 4k quality and i'm gonna put mystical because it kind of you know the fruit kind of looks mystical let's see what it what it thinks and on top of the fruit there's a halo so hopefully it includes a halo oh my goodness so this is what it thinks that spirit fruit is that looks like a tentacle like an octopus tentacle this one is under the water it's like a little sea creature this one's my favorite this part right here a little bit looks like the discord logo which is kind of funny okay so this is what it thought that the dragon fruit looks like this looks so cool i don't like how like extremely spiny it is because it's kind of like freaking me out a little bit but the the horns are so cool it looks like a balloon animal or something like that this is cool now last but not least but we're going to be putting in the leopard fruit now i'm going to put leopard and then fruit 4k quality and let's see what comes up i might do a part two to this so let me know if you want me to put any other parts of blocks fruits into mid journey because this was a lot of fun and it was really cool just to see what ai thought of the blocks fruits like fruits so if you want me to do that for other roblox games or different parts of blocks fruits let me know in the comment section because you know that'd be really cool look at these leopards with their fruits oh this is so cool this looks like an aloe vera stem this this one is my favorite by far if you have trypophobia i'm sorry because this probably would freak some people out so that is what ai thinks of the fruits in blocks fruits if you want me to try and do some of like the swords like dragon trident would be so cool rengoku dark blade would be really cool let me know if you want a part two to this because i think that this was so cool uh just seeing what ai thinks of blocks fruits but yeah use starco julian because this was an expensive video to make